and I had to go to the hospital and get stitches. What's up, B-Nation? So today we are doing something pretty fun. Today we are at Thailand's biggest mall. It is the Central World Mall here in Bangkok, Thailand. So as Thailand's very biggest mall, it has a great combination of like super high-end brands like Gucci and Versace and all that stuff, and then some lower-end apparel. And what I find to be the most exciting part is that the very two top layers, six and seven, are devoted only to food. But for the biggest mall in Thailand, this happens to be a very small mess. Just made it to a sporting goods store, and this is awesome because I need some new shoes. I have a hole in my shoe. Every time I step in water, it's bad. And Leah is looking for some goggles. Because <gasps> we're going somewhere tropical soon. I won't disclose. Um, excuse me. Why are there field hockey sticks here? Since when is field hockey a sport they play in Thailand? So I used to play field hockey in high school. On my 18th birthday, a girl hit me in the face with a stick and I had to go to the hospital and get stitches. I don't think I've ever been in a sporting store that's this interactive. People are playing sports everywhere, testing every single piece of equipment. Normally in sports stores in America, people just go they buy what they're looking for, and they don't ever test it out. This is awesome. And since we're going somewhere tropical soon, we decided to invest in some goggles. They have the cutest stuff here. But it is 100 degrees Fahrenheit outside, I don't think. But it's so cute. And because I have the hole in my shoe, we're looking for shoes, but it's very difficult to find 47, so good luck with this. We found some 46s, not 48, but I'll try them on, and our budget is $11 for finished shoes, so this hits the mark. Okay, so here's the hole in my other shoe. Which shoe do you guys think I should get? This one or this one? Vote in the comment section below. I'm leaning towards the gray. They're so much more comfortable, but this has more support. Mm -hmm. Okay, so the ones that I like didn't make the cut. The question is, should I spend $10 to get shoes for three months and then get more when I get back, or just deal with the hole in my shoe and avoid the water? Sadly, we're not gonna get the shoes today. Maybe another day, but my the ones I have right now are just too comfortable, so on the next place. It's so good to see that apartment stores are alive and well here in Thailand. In America, they're kind of fading because we don't care about service as much, but here, they are so hands-on. This is so cool. It's a box of donuts, and that's the store. Whew. Okay, so we've been doing a lot of walking around, and we've worked up an appetite. Yes. So now we're looking for places to eat, but there are so many to choose from. It's really overwhelming. Everywhere looks really, really good. It's kind of expensive. So we're looking for the perfect place. I think we found it. Oh my gosh, they have an entire grocery store in this mall. Very interesting. China, America, France, Elvis.
Okay, so the way it works is that you have a cash card, you go up to the counter, kind of like a ticket, almost. you put money on your cash card, and then you are able to pay at the stand, so you don't have to like fumble through money and like get gross money bacteria on you. So you get your silverware and then you sterilize it in this blue light until it beeps. But I guess you know your course are clean. We have stir fried glass noodles with some type of meat and it looks like an egg and a veggie omelet. We have stewed pork leg with fried pork on rice and veggies. And we have our favorite cow soy with chicken, mustard greens, onions. Oh, so excited. So the stewed pork leg is really, really tender. It tastes like delicious, like cold pork before you put the sauce over top of it. And it's served in its own juices and it's really good. Cow soy for the first time in over a month. It's just the right spiciness. It's so creamy. It's got a good chicken broth flavor. And the crunchy onions, or the onions, crunchy noodles on top are amazing. Okay, now for this slice of pizza of an omelet. I thought it was actually a cake when I ordered it. I didn't know it was egg. So let's see how this tastes. It's really, really good. There's a true omelet. It's full of vegetables. The egg is really just holding everything together. And it's like, it's like a slice of cake. Super dense. So we found this awesome jungle gym type structure for adults. I think it's just for relaxing, but it looks pretty cool. It's really interesting to be here right now. The Thailand Toy Expo is actually going on in this mall. It starts tomorrow. They're setting up today. This is crazy. That's a wrap, this place was so big, I don't even think we scratched the surface. Nope, we ate, we walked around, we saw lots of cool shops. We definitely used the air conditioning today because Bangkok is so hot and we stole some Wi-Fi. So overall, it's been a great day. Great day. <laughs> what? Just in time for Easter. <laughs> Coral, goggles, hey, ooh! So fancy!